the Republic has joined 12 other countries in condemning attacks by Houthi militants on commercial ships in the Red Sea, warning of consequences if they continue. In a joint statement issued through the White House's briefing room on January 3 U.S. time, the 13 countries called for an end to the ongoing Houthi attacks, which are illegal, unacceptable, and profoundly destabilizing. There is no lawful justification for intentionally targeting civilian shipping and naval vessels. The statement said. The attacks, including the use of anti-ship ballistic missiles, threaten freedom of navigation in one of the world's most critical waterways, the statement added. These attacks threaten innocent lives from all over the world and constitute a significant international problem that demands collective action. Nearly 15% of global seaborne trade passes through the Red Sea, which acts as the entry point to the Suez Canal, the shortest shipping route between Europe and Asia. As a result of the attacks, which began in November, major shipping companies have had to reroute their ships around South Africa's Cape of Good Hope, adding costs, delaying deliveries, and jeopardizing the movement of food, fuel and humanitarian assistance throughout the world, said the statement. Let our message now be clear. We call for the immediate end of these illegal attacks and release of unlawfully detained vessels and crews. The Houthis will bear the responsibility of the consequences should they continue to threaten lives, the global economy, and free flow of commerce in the region's critical waterways. Besides Singapore, the statement was signed by the United States, Australia, Bahrain, Belgium, Canada, Denmark, Germany, Italy, Japan, the Netherlands, New Zealand and Britain. It came shortly after members of the United Nations Security Council called for a halt to the Houthis' attacks during its first formal meeting of the year on January 3. The attacks are an attempt to pressure Israel into stopping its war against Hamas in the Gaza Strip. On December 31, the militants attempted to board the Singapore flag Mass Hangzhou, a container ship owned and operated by Denmark. U.S. forces sunk three ships and killed ten of the Iran-backed militants then. With mass pausing all sailing through the Red Sea for 48 hours after the attack.